Hello everyone, we are now here with Danganronpa episode 5, and if you remember in the last episode, we are supposed to go um, meet up with Sayaka for free time, and we are going to go do that wherever she's at. Oh, there's Junko. Um, Alright, the map. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, she's in her room. Okay. Then we can just go back to the dorms. Sorry if it's lagging a little bit. Okay, so she's in her room. I guess I should press the doorbell. Um, listen. You know, Makoto, I'm so anxious. I really am afraid. Hmm, should I talk to Saika for a while? I mean, they won't give us any other choices. Trust me, I've tried. You have to spend time with her first, but then you are free to spend time with whoever you choose. So, um, are you going to try and cheer me up? Sorry. Sorry for making you take time out of your day like this. I did my best to comfort Saika. Saika and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Saika a present? I forgot to give presents, so... Um... Um, Makoto? Do you think you can make time for the two of us to talk? What's wrong? Why are you being so formal? I... Well, it's just... I guess that was kind of formal, but... It's just because I know I can count on you. Huh? <laughs> Having you by my side really makes me feel a lot better. If you weren't here with me, I just don't know what I'd do. I'd be lost. But that's why... I hate that we had to meet again under such awful conditions, but I'm relieved you're with me. Sayaka. Standing here face to face here and hearing her say that, it's nice, but kind of embarrassing at the same time. I know how you feel. You being here is what saved me. <sighs> really? <laughs> Thank you for the flattery. That smile, that mysterious smile that softens my heart. I really wasn't flattering her. That smile saved me. Okay, Makoto, we get it. You're in love. <sighs> but it's kind of strange, you know? I never thought I'd get a chance to really talk to you like this. All through middle school, you never talked to me. In fact, you never even looked at me. Oh, but I watched you all the time, Makoto. Every day. <laughs> I can't help it. I have to make fun of it. I'm sorry. Because you were like a celebrity, I couldn't just go around staring at you, but were you staring at me, Sayaka? Because how would you notice someone like me? Wait, how do you know I never looked at you? Exactly my point, guys. Exactly my point. Hey, um... Because I looked at you all the time. I watched you day and night. Huh? I... I was always looking for an opportunity to talk to you. You wanted to talk to me? But... But since I always had so many people around me, we ended up graduating without saying a word. That was one of my biggest regrets. But why me? Uh, Do you remember during our first year of junior high, that huge bird wandered into the school pond? Actually, now that I think about it, I do sort of remember something like that. It was like out of a fairy tale. The turtle once every million years. That bird once every thousand. A huge bird wandered into the school pond during our first year of junior high. I think it might have been... A crane. It was a crane. It just walked right into the pond. Okay. That's right. That's what it was. It was so big, the teacher had no idea what to do. <laughs> but you led it into the forest behind the school. You helped it find its way out. Well, only because I was already in charge of taking care of the animals at school, they made me do it. You see, I should have had I should have said thank you then, but is it okay if I do now? Thank me. I I'm that crane, you see. I've come to return the favor. Here, let me make you a cloak. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah, I kind of figured. But honestly, though, I was so impressed. That's why I always wanted to talk to you, even just once. Uh, um... I never imagined this would be how I got my chance. Yeah, if we'd met again at a train station somewhere downtown, that'd make for a nice dramatic reunion. But instead, it's this weird school. I... Maybe, but still. I'm sure you'll help me find my way out, just like that crane. You'll save me. You see... It's just intuition, I know, but I still believe it. 
I'm going to save her? I'll do my best, I promise that. I'll make sure it's more than just intuition. If there's anything I can do, I'm going to do it. <laughs> I believe in you. Besides, my intuition always turns out to be right. Like I said, I'm psychic. Yeah, yeah, we get it, you're psychic. Or, yeah, you know what I mean. <laughs> kidding, kidding. She laughed out loud as she said it. The closer we get, the stronger that smile of hers makes me. I was glad to feel that way. Psycho's report card has been updated based on your experience with her. You just unlocked the skill of Melodious Voice. Give yourself a pat on the back. You've earned it. Once we were all done, I headed back to my room for a little while. And of course, it's already nighttime. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, we get it, Monokuma. It's, it's the same the thing over and over. Hall. Okay, then. Seriously, it's the same recording over and over. So it's like, I'm going to skip those most of the time, if not all the time. I just let them play the first time around so you guys could see them, but it's the same thing every night and morning. I hate to burst your bubble, but yeah, he doesn't say anything new. So, but I swear, tomorrow I'm going to find some kind of clue. Did I forget to read that? Oh, sorry. Today's already come to an end. There. But I swear, tomorrow I'm going to find some kind of clue. I swear! Balls asleep. <laughs> As my eyelids began to slide closed, the conversation I'd had with Sayaka that morning began to replay. In a way, it's almost frustrating. Even if I understand where her desperation is coming from, I can't share in it. The pressure she's under is way different from anything a normal high schooler like me goes through. She didn't just stumble into this school the way I did. So I can't say I feel things the way she does. Compared to her, no, compared to everyone else here, there's no doubt I just don't match up. I guess that might expl explain my own frustration. Ahem! So, I'm sure that you've noticed the killing game has begun, but... There's still room for a little laughter! It seems our newest students, already so filled with despair, still have some hope to escape. Boo, 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 boo. So when will it begin? When will their hope begin to die? Is it time yet? Is it time? Heart-pounding excitement! Yeah, for you maybe, but for some of us, yeah. Whatever. You're messed up. Anyways. Mm, morning already? Oh, okay. Got a bed, Makoto. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Get ready. To okay, yeah, we'll greet it. But yeah, morning has come. What should I do today? Okay, now I'm gonna go get presents because I forgot to go do that. And where do we get those? Oh wait, I only have one coin. Oh wait, hold on. Okay, yeah, I only have one coin. Forget this isn't like my old save file where I had tons of coins. But you know, maybe if I go explore and earn some, then I'm gonna go do that real quick. And show you guys the school! Yay! Let's look at the laundry. Because I know you can get some coins here. A washing machine, not surprising. This is the laundry room after all. See what I tell you. I've gotten like quite a few coins here, so. There's a swimsuit hanging out to dry. I wonder if it's Hina's. I wonder whose it is. I mean, I really want to know. I'm sure you do, Makoto. I'm sure you do. It's Heroes. <laughs> Aren't I funny? No? Okay. I'll shut up now. There's some magazines laying around. Probably to kill time while you're waiting for your laundry. Oh, that didn't give me a coin. Okay, let's see. A surveillance camera. Oh, no! Don't watch me strip in front of the laundry mat! Oh, sorry. I have to wash these clothes. I hate the idea that someone might be watching me right now as I take my clothes off to put them in the laundry. Oh no! I have to keep in mind that it's against school regulations to mess with any of the cameras. As much as it gets on my nerves, I better leave it alone. So I just had to make the joke of Makoto, like, taking off his clothes, putting them in the laundry. Oh no, they're seeing me naked! A washing machine, not surprising, blah blah blah, okay. I think he can, uh, hold on. I forgot which one I already clicked. I think multiple ones gave you points? I can't remember. So 
sorry, I'm, I'm, I swear I'm not gonna- Okay, so they're not gonna give me coins anymore. Okay. Oh yeah, this, this little thing right here. A vending machine! It's always nice to have a drink while your laundry gets done. This is one of the monitors Monokuma appears on. Right now, it's just showing the school crest. I don't even want to think about when he might show up on the thing next. Erg. Poor Makoto. It's okay, Makoto. We're here for you. Okay, that's it. So what, I got two more coins there? Mm. Yeah, so I have like three. Okay. Uh, it's lagging a bit. Why? Oh well. I guess that's okay if it lags a bit. Mm. At least it's not, like, very bad. It hardly does lag, though. Oh, yeah! We never got to check out the kitchen, did we? Oh, yeah, it really is stocked with... I mean, I knew that, of course, but... I'm just like, Oh, guys, look! There's tons of food! Oh, wait, you guys already found out. Col I just like the colorfulness of all the, like, vegetables and fruits. Colorful vegetables have been stacked in a huge pile. There's so many different kinds, and all super healthy, I bet. Still, I'd rather have some cake. God damn it, Makoto, you gotta start eating healthy. Keep telling people this, eat your damn vegetables. I'm like Iggy in Final Fantasy XV. Eat your vegetables, Noctis. No, I want cup noodles. There are some knives hanging on the wall. Uh-oh, be careful, Makoto. Don't touch those and accidentally stab yourself, because you're the kind of person who totally would. I mean, I'm just saying. I can just see Makoto grab a knife. I accidentally stabbed myself in the chest. Oops. Makoto, did you just stab yourself? No. Okay. There's a whole bunch of different kinds. I had no idea you needed so many to cook. Yeah, he tried cooking with them and cut his finger off. I could just. I'm sorry, I'm making fun of Makoto. I love him, but he's such like he's he's such a ditz. It's so funny. Well, not a ditz, but like I could. He's such a klutz, though. It's a Dilly style display case. Time to cut some beef, yo. There are all kinds of food and stuff lined up inside. I think I see some fish too. Okay. I know I'm being super random in this episode, but just eh. Wait, can I click on the trash can? Oh no, it's just a, okay, it's this again. I don't know why I thought I could click on the trash can, but what the Okay. I don't think I need to examine the camera. It's just the same thing in each like room. Every room has those damn cameras. Okay. Sorry, I'm just, like, farming coins here. There's a clock telling me what time it is, but I can't see outside, so I have no idea if it's even right. Well, I mean, I don't think it's wrong. So, okay. Now I'm gonna go spend those coins. I think I've earned enough. Let's see. I think I have, like, five, four or five. Okay, I have five. That's good enough for a start. Okay. That, oh, right, I have to go this way. That's where the, um, mono mono machine is. And into the school store. Look at all the neat stuff. I mean, yeah. Don't touch it, might be breakable. Yeah, this is definitely the school store, but it has kind of a Japanese Western blend. It seems more like a cluttered antique store. But I kind of like those. I don't know. They're fun to look around in window shop. A vending machine. I guess this must be the school store then. No, Makoto, you stepped into the depths of hell. Oh, I stopped. Okay, I looked at that already. Oh, yeah, give me another coin, didn't I? Oh, I have CX. Okay. Time to check out the Mono Mono Machine, guys. What's this? Oh, maybe if I turn the knob, a price will come out. Would you like to try your hand against the almighty Mono Mono Machine? Yep. All right, let's give it a shot. Okay. So I got six coins, and yes, this is the Mono Mono Machine. It's kind of one of my favorite things in the game because it's fun to collect stuff. I like collecting things in games, so I mean... Aww! A, a bunny headband. It does take a while, though. Oh! Is that a... It looks like a fountain pen or something. Oh, the rose in the bottle. It doesn't say what items they are, so if I know what they are, I'll tell them to you guys in case you can't tell. I think that was a, was that a bag or something? I think it was a bag or 
suitcase or whatever, but I can't remember. Oh, that gold gun thing or whatever. Okay, last one. I keep getting those in my in like my last game. I don't know. Okay, so that's it. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I pressed the the wrong button. I should probably get going. See, I'm used to pressing the escape key, but that just brings up the like guide or whatever. Which and which in reality it's the R key if you want to like leave. But I keep pressing the escape key. Okay, who do you think I'm going to be spending time with? Raise of hands. Make your predictions now, because I'm sure it's it's bluntly obvious who my favorites are. I mentioned that before. Although, I already spent a lot of time with them in the last game. Like, I filled up the report cards. But, since this is a new game, I figured I can, you know, do them all over again. Or not spend time with people like, where are the classrooms? Did I pass them? I'm so stupid. Oh, Chihiro! Okay, um, that's the main hall. Don't want to go there. There's probably no one there. Oh, wait, duh, classrooms are over here. I'm so stupid. I'm sorry. When you're trying to narrate and move around, you like, like sometimes I only half pay attention. Okay. Okay, guys, I'm gonna be spending time with Kyoga. Just kidding. I'm right, right? I mean, this school is totally elite and unique, right? So maybe this is normal for them. What do you think, Makoto? I think I love you. I mean, should I hang out with Makoto? I mean, Makoto. Yeah, I'm gonna hang with myself. <laughs> should I hang with Hiro for a while? I'm sorry, it's been a long day. Excuse me. Spend time with Hiro. Duh. Yeah. You wanna go grab a bite to eat in the dining hall? I'll teach you where all the best power spots are. Hero taught me all about the best power spots. Yay. I guess. Hero and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Hero a present? Oh. Did I get anything that would work for him? Because, like, I, I know what gifts he loves and which ones he doesn't. I mean, why would I know that? I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna give him some bunny earmuffs. No. I don't know if he liked the rose. I don't think I've tried that on him before. Look out, good for my famous assassin. Don't like much. Okay, that, that I don't think that's his style or tastes. Okay, it's a hand, that was a handbag I got. He wouldn't like that. I don't think. Um, out of everything I got, I would. Oh, okay. Oh, I know who would like that. Darn, I should have went with her instead. I'll save that for her. And yes, I mean Toko because duh. So yeah, I'll give that to Toko next time. I didn't get that in my last game. I wish I did that. I could have given it to her. I'll try the rose. Why not? I wonder how much I could get for this at a pawn shop. Gee, thanks. I give you a token of my love and you're going to sell it? How rude. <laughs> okay, good. Kidding, kidding. I appreciate it, really. And I'm totally gonna put it in my window. Wait, we don't have windows. God damn it. Does that mean he liked it? Could it be? Hey, Makoto, you know what I think? You and me meeting like this? It wasn't a coincidence. Hmm. So I've got some good news for you. I'm gonna give you a psychic reading at a huge discount. A discount? How about that? Normally it's a thousand bucks for two hours, but for you, let's call it 900. Sure, let me just go sell an arm and a leg first. I'll be back. That's only a hundred dollar discount, and even then it's way too expensive. Don't be mean. Hey, come on. You should count yourself lucky that the ultimate clairvoyant is willing to tell your future. So, are you right pretty often, Makoto? You don't want to ask that question. Well? I sure am! The bare minimum, I got a 20% chance of accuracy! 20%? That sounds pretty sketchy. What the heck? For real? Don't make that face! Didn't you hear what I said? 20% of the time I'm right, every time! That includes natural disasters, election results, you name it! Don't you realize how amazing that is? I'm totally amazing, Makoto. You should know that by now. Um... I'm gonna go hang with someone else later. How about that? Okay, fine. I'll give you a special trial run. After all, I've already seen what the future has in store for you. It's got me in it, that's for sure. Wink, wink. 
What? When did you see it? Well? <laughs> you won't believe what I saw. Do you take it? It would appear that... <laughs> I, got, I almost forgot about this. Oh my god. It would appear that the mother of your children and the mother of my children are the same woman. Except that it's not. It's you. I'm, I'm just kidding. But I for... Oh my god. I forgot about that. I refuse! Deny! Don't like it! Don't worry, Makoto. Just just don't worry. He's wrong. He's wrong! Obviously. But, you know. I'm right, right? Doesn't matter if you don't like it. That's just the way it is. Unless you want to marry me. 20% accuracy, you say? You know? At least. <laughs> I pray to everything holy that you're wrong. Please be wrong. <laughs> now then, since that was a special trial run, I'm afraid I can't apply to this camp. Yeah, I mean, as much as I love Hero, he is pretty, uh, yeah, it's pretty special. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Um, he's, he's something, though. That'll be $1,000, please. Don't worry, you can pay me after we get out of here. I swear I didn't hit my head before coming to this school. Wait, hold on. But there's no way you're going to be right, right? Mm -hmm. If you like, I can do reading right now to see whether my reading was right or not. Yeah, someone must have hit his head way back when. Did someone throw rocks at you when you were a child hero? Because, I mean... Yeah... Naturally, additional fees will apply. <laughs> Think about it, okay? Let me know as soon as you're ready for my services. <laughs> services? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm going to make, make tons of innuendos. If you don't like those, you can stop watching my playthroughs. But if you don't mind them, then you can continue. <laughs> Bye, Makoto. Oh, he's gone. Do I have enough in my bank account to take another crack at it? No, I can't bring myself to pay for something like that. I can see how people can fall into that kind of cycle, though. That was close. Please, whoever's listening, I'm begging you. Whatever else happens, don't let him be right. Your support card has been updated based on your experience with him. You just unlocked the skill lost in thought because you're thinking about Hero too much. Now snap out of it. Give yourself a pat on the back. You earned it. Once we were all done, I headed back to my room for a little while. I might make this episode a bit short just because... But yeah. There's still lots of time left in the day. I really don't feel like just sitting here. Maybe I'll take a look around. Let's go find Toko and give her that pen before I forget. Okay, so... Wait, what am I doing? I should just find where she is. Okay. Oh, uh, Sakura. Sakura is like one of my other favorites. Like, not like ultimate favorites, but... She's cool. Oh, Toka's in her room. Okay. Well, let's go back then. Okay, which one's hers again? I get lost all the time. Okay, there we go. Right there. Yay! I guess I should press the doorbell. <laughs> Leave me alone. You don't have to pay attention to me. Should I hang out with Toko for a while? Yep. <laughs> Just do whatever you want. I spend some time with Toko. <laughs> I love that each time you spend time with her, she makes that face after. It's just it's so funny. Toko and I grew a little closer today, and I'm not sure if I'm happy about that, but okay. Bye, Toko. Don't don't be following me around now. Saika's already doing that. Would you like to give Toko a present? Yes, because I have something she will love. For once. Well, I think I, I had a few other things she liked, but nothing that, like... Nothing like this pen, though, because this pen's perfect. Should have gone the other way. Damn. Oh, well. Where is it? Okay. There it is. <laughs> Sorry, but I'm already engaged to master. Oh. Why is she saying that now? We have we haven't gotten that far It's okay. It's not really a spoiler, but you'll see who she's talking about later. They haven't revealed that yet, but I'm just saying I'm like, wait, we haven't gotten to that part in the game yet, but I'm not going to spoil anything for those who are new and they're like, who the hell is this master person? 
trust me, you'll find out soon enough. You'll find out. So I can't go on a date with you. If you're okay with that, I don't mind if you think about me. Seeing Toko so pleased with something I gave her makes me happy. It does? Okay. I mean, I love Toko, but yeah. Dots. More dots. She's just standing there. Does she want something? Not you, Makoto, that's for sure. No offense, but... Dots. But she's not saying anything. I mean, maybe she does. Okay. Dots. Maybe I should try to start a conversation? Um, Toko? <laughs> what? You want to talk to me? Well, I can't stop you, so talk already. Okay, sh Excuse me. Okay, sure, but what should I say? So, uh, what do you like to do in your spare time? <laughs> Why do you want to know? Well, I mean, you know, we're trapped here together, right? If we're going to be friends, it'd be nice to get to know each other. Uh. What did you just say? Um... <laughs> after that part about being trapped, we're going to be what? Uh, friends? <laughs> 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 what do you mean, friends? You think I'm stupid? You're trying to trick me. I've already been hurt once before. I'm not gonna let it happen again. You've been hurt? What happened? Anyway... Come on. You don't really care about me. You don't want to know about me. Even I know that. No, that's, that's not true. <laughs> what the heck? Fine. Then tell me. Tell you what? <laughs> you know why they call me the ultimate writing prodigy, right? Yeah, sure, you won all kinds of literature prizes and stuff. <laughs> then tell me what I'm good at. Tell me what my genre specialty is. If you really want to convince me you give a crap, you should at least know that. The genre of the ultimate writing prodigy, it's romance. It's romance, of course. <laughs> oh, you actually knew? Your biggest success was Solinger's The Ocean, right? Everyone says it's your masterpiece. The book was such a hit that fishermen shot at the top of all the hottest men poles, right? <laughs> How did you know all that? There's no way you care about me. I'm telling you, I do. I mean, we're friends, aren't we? Huh? I'm, I'm blind. Your straightforward nature blinded me. Yeah! Toka ran off screaming like a banshee. <laughs> This is why I love Toko. I'm not really sure. Does she hate me now? No, nah, that's just how she is. Trust me. You unlock the skill vocabulary. Yay! We're unlocking all them skills, yo. Give yourself a pat on the back. You've earned it. Once we were all done, I headed back to my room for a little while. And there's the nighttime alert. Which I'm probably going to skip over again. Like I said, it's the same thing. <clears throat> As such, soon the doors to the dungeon. Okay, yeah, yeah, then. let me go to bed, Makoto. I mean, Marakuma. Why do I keep saying Makoto? I am. It's been a long day. Okay, like I said, the third day here has already come to an end. When will I. No, we. When are we going to get out of here? I laid on my bed and stared blankly at the ceiling. And before I knew it, I'd fallen into an uneasy sleep. I need an immediate, fast-acting pick-me-up. If it doesn't act now, it's the same as giving into regret. What do you think guides the world? Speed, of course. That's why Formula One drivers are so popular. Any idiot can accomplish something if they take it slow. Even a human piece of excrement could create a masterpiece if they spent their entire life on it. Someone who does things in a timely fashion is both wise and admirable. Straight is better than a curve for an angle. Freestyle is better than a backstroke or the breaststroke. Drive through is better than sit down. A Sunday comic artist is smarter than a graphic novelist. What I'm saying is, speed is the gold standard of the standard world. Not exactly, Monokuma, but I mean, keep telling yourself that. Which is why I said I need that pick-me-up. Go find it somewhere else. Meanwhile, 0000.002 000 seconds later. <laughs> yeah, I just don't know. Okay, okay, we get it, Monokuma. God damn, it's morning. Let me go back to bed. F you. Good morning, everyone. Get ready to... 
I don't want to greet another day. God, go away. I woke up to the irritating sound of Monokuma's voice. I slowly, very slowly, pulled myself out of bed. <laughs> another night of restless sleep. Day after day, I can feel the fatigue piling up. Soon as the thought had crossed my mind. Oh, who's at my door? Let me guess. Mrs. I love you, Makoto. I followed you all around junior high school. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I always joke about that. Okay, the sound of the doorbell forced its way into my room. Uh, go away, I'm so tired. Let me go back to sleep. Oh, that's right, it's Taka. Well, I forgot it wasn't Sayaka, okay? Because, you know, she's always like, Oh, Makoto, oh, Makoto. Yeah, spoiler alert, she's going to be doing that more often. A fantastic morning, isn't it? Taka? Taka, I'm still trying to get dressed. Close the door! Hmm. Now then, if you'll pardon the interruption. Without waiting for a reply, Taka barged into my room. I'm trying to get dressed, Taka! Stop it! But jeez, go away. I'm just kidding. What's up, Taka? Please, please totally do not be watching me change clothes right now. Okay, can you look the other way? Thanks. <laughs> no matter how intensely the stormy seas may batter me, I will not fall as long as my feet are firmly planted. You got that? I'm totally not steering, Makoto. You agree, right? Um, I'm not sure I understand. Without a doubt. And if you can't do it alone, just find someone to support you, and you can support them back. You hear me? That's how you can overcome any storm. Okay. I was thinking about it last night, and... I decided we all need to really come together. Oh yeah, that's how this starts, okay. And that was when I realized, every morning from now on, after the morning announcement, everyone should have breakfast together. Quiet down and and now is the beginning of that fateful day. Please head to the dining hall at your earliest convenience. Got it! That's all for now. I have to go let everyone else know the good news. Taka didn't even wait for a reply. He turned and left before I could say a thing. Well, I guess I better head to the dining hall. Okay, I'm gonna end this episode here. And if it's shorter than the others, I apologize. Just, I wanted to make this one short. But maybe after this one, I'll make the rest like longer. I mean, longer than 40 minutes like the other couple have been. But yeah, so I will see you guys in the next episode. And hopefully this one does not take me so long to edit. I should not have any issues with audio or video this time hopefully so this one should go up quickly as soon as I get the last one up as well okay so I'll see you later guys take care <laughs>